Hello guys, it's your host Alan, so today I'm going to be talking about what I have learned. So basically it's going to be about video game culture. So video games is something that people play on a daily basis. So I'm going to talk to you about the, the characteristics of video games. First of all, video games is very entertaining for people, especially like teenagers and adults. Little kids like to play video games because they don't want to be bored in the house. I mean, when I was little, I used to play Mario, which was my first video game character. I used to play Mario Party series, I used to play Yoshi Island, Luigi's Mansion, etc. And I even played Crazy Taxi. It was a, it was a fun game, but it has cussing words in it. And that's the problem with kids. They cuss too much. Especially teenagers. They're going to grow, become become adults that looks like them. So I will advise you not to play violent video games, teenagers, because that stuff will get into your mind. And you might end up being a criminal and shoot somebody. So playing video games is very fun, but children got to be careful what they're playing. They can be playing Grand Theft Auto, um, Call of Duty, and all the kinds of video, violent video games that can lead to deadly death. That can end up getting killed. That's why I advise parents to buy games that is not violent for children nowadays because you can't you can't play video games. I mean, you can't play violent video games. Because these characters have cussing words in it. So if you want to play video games, play video games. I will people play video games all day long and they become very addicting. It's like very being addicted to alcohol, alcohol and drugs. Because drugs and alcohol are very bad substances that people can be risky to be risky to I'm sorry so being risky to drugs and be risky to alcohol can lead to death I mean they can lead to a negative effect on people so if you are addicted to drugs your mind is going crazy like alcohol you're, you're drinking that's why you have to be 21 or older to drink alcohol because that's the law no people under 21 should be drinking at all because they will throw up if I don't care what people say you can't drink until you're 21 and you can't smoke because it will affect your lung cancer so video games is very addicting I will advise people not to play violent video games. I never play violent video games, to be honest with you. I always like fun games, like I stated before. Mario, Luigi's Mansion, Crazy Taxi, Yoshi Island, um, Nicktoons Unite. That was my favorite game because it features Nicktoons Unite, features Danny Phantom, Jimmy Neutron, SpongeBob SquarePants, and Timmy Turner from the Furly Odd Parents. And that game wasn't so violent. It was action fun. So it's like I never want to play violent video games because I don't want craziness to get into my mind because I'm a nice I'm a nice person. I'm nice to anyone. Yes, there are times that we can be violent in life, but this isn't a way to have fun. Because I have seen children and young people being killed because they've been playing violent video games and they hate each other. Why do you hate each other when you're supposed to show love? Showing love is very important nowadays because you use you get to spend more time with people than you do with video games. So I would advise people, 
I don't advise teenagers, and I'm going to get to you now. Teenagers, spend time with your friends and family. And don't spend too much time playing violent video games because your, your mindset will be very negative. Always do your homework. Always do something important before you play video games. And have somebody, have your friends with you when you play video games because it's very socializing. So, this is called video game culture, the violent and the pros and cons of playing video games. So, you can't, you can't play video games all day and every day because you want to do something very different, like fun, like spending time with your family. That's what I'm talking about, brother. Spend time with your family. Mm. Excuse me, sorry for burping. So... So yeah, that's what I was talking about in psychology class in college. I was talking about the the characteristics of violent video game in culture as of today. So playing violent video games is not fun way. It's very very critical. So I will advise you to stay off violent video games and play nice video games like. NBA, NFL, like Madden. I've seen people are very addicted to Madden because they got their favorite teams and they're very addicted to any sports that they that they endure. They analyze people. Like I got a Madden game and uh, the teams I admire are Baltimore Ravens, Green Bay Packers, New England Patriots, and Washington Redskins. And those are the games that I like the most. And then, when people, when NBA, I'm very, I very love Lakers, Los Angeles Lakers, and Miami Heat. So yeah, I live in Baltimore right now. The teams I have is Orioles, baseball, Ravens, football. So be careful when you play video games, alright? Alright y'all, so peace out and I'll see you later. Peace.